The death of DeAndre Ballard has sparked several protests around Durham. The 23-year-old NCCU student died after being shot at Campus Crossings Apartments in September. No one has been charged in his death. Today, during a tour of the new headquarters for Durham Police, Chief C.J. Davis talked to me for the first time about Ballard's shooting. The only thing I can say is that that particular case is still under investigation, and unfortunately I can't go any deeper than that right now. NC Detective Agency, a security firm contracted with the apartment complex, has said one of its guards shot Ballard and the shooting was 100% justified. Is there a message just for the public because they haven't heard much from police? They, yes, they have. Yeah. Um, and the message is, is that I, I sincerely hope that the community has enough confidence, not just in our police department, but in my leadership to ensure that an investigation is thorough because that family deserves a thorough investigation and that the decisions that are made are made after we have received all of the information that is um, needed in order to reach a, an appropriate conclusion. I talked to DeAndre Ballard's mother, Arnisha Ballard, over the phone. I guess they're just waiting to get most of the evidence in there. To, to make that decision. After identifying Ballard in the shooting, Durham police have released 911 calls and a statement about why it took days to identify his body. For now, the community and Ballard's family continue to wait. Do you have trust in the police department and the work that they're doing in the investigation? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Supporters for DeAndre Ballard will be protesting again this Saturday here outside Durham Police Department's new headquarters during its grand opening. In Durham, I'm Derek Lewis, CBS 17 News.